In this example, the customer wanted to be able to see information about financial performance of various organizational units at a glance. They needed to see the information at various levels, ranging from nationwide all the way down to individual plants. It was also very important to quickly compare the performance of different organizational units to see who had the best and worst performance. For purposes of this demonstration, we've limited the data to just three types of revenue figures, planned, actuals, and the ratio of actual to planned, expressed as a percentage. For this application, Johnston McLam developed a thematic map where we use color to show data about various types of geographic areas. The display consists of several components. The map shows the various geographic areas colored to indicate the values of data being displayed. The map legend shows the data range associated with each color. At the customer's request, we added a bar graph under the map to show data in an additional way. The customer also wanted to see a listing of the top 10 and bottom 10 regions ranked by their year-to-date revenue, so we added that as well. This is an excellent example of how additional methods of displaying data can supplement a map. To make the display even more valuable, we provided users with a number of interactive tools and controls. There are two drop-down lists just above the map. The geography level list is used to choose whether data will be displayed by area or region. The data drop-down list is used to select the type of data to be displayed on the map and bar graph. For purposes of this demo, there are only three choices, actual year-to-date revenue, planned revenue, and how actual year-to-date revenue compares to planned. Here we see actual year-to-date revenue for each area on both the map and the bar graph. Now let's look at data by area. Click on area in the geography level drop-down list. Now let's say you want to focus on the southeast area. An easy way to do this is to click on the southeast bar in the bar graph. The map zooms into the southeast area and centers it in the display area. Now let's see more data about southeast. You click anywhere within that area on the map. A callout appears showing more data about the southeast area. In addition, the bar graph changes to show all regions within the southeast area. Now let's look at another type of data. In the data drop-down list, click on percent to plan. Both the map and the bar graph change to show the relationship between actual revenue and planned revenue expressed as a percentage. Now let's drill down again to see the regions in the southeast area. We'll click on region in the geography level drop-down list. Now you see the actual versus planned revenue data at a regional level. Now let's drill down again to see data for the plants in the Atlanta region. Click on the Atlanta region on the map. The bar graph changes to show two plants in the Atlanta region. This is an example of how easy it is to drill down to a finer level of detail. Another way to focus on a different region is to click on one of the regions in the top 10, bottom 10 list. Click on Albany in the top 10 regions list. The map centers on the Albany region. So we have demonstrated three different ways to focus on an area of interest by clicking on the map, clicking on a bar in the bar graph, or clicking on a region in the top 10, bottom 10 list. Another way to change the view on the map is to use the zoom slider to zoom in or out. Also, you can drag the map to a new location. So what we have seen here is how Johnston McLam has enhanced the value of a thematic map by providing multiple ways of displaying the data all in the same screen and by giving the user interactive control over what is being displayed. Because the application is directly connected to the database, there is no waiting for the map to be regenerated after the user chooses the type of data to display. Also, when the data in the database is updated, the results are immediately reflected in the display. If you would like to find out more about Johnston McLam's Visual Business Intelligence Solutions, please get in touch with us. We look forward to speaking with you.